A Japanese court has cleared three former executives of professional negligence in the only criminal trial stemming from the 2011 Fukushima nuclear meltdown. The disaster triggered a tsunami which left nearly 18,500 people dead or missing. The three men were senior officials at Tokyo Electric Power Company. The three former TEPCO bosses had faced trial in relation to the deaths of more than 40 hospitalized people who died after having to be evacuated following the Fukushima disaster. But a Tokyo court ruled today that they were not guilty of professional negligence. This is incredibly frustrating. It's totally unacceptable. On March 11, 2011, a powerful earthquake struck off Japan's northeast coast and triggered a massive tsunami. Enormous waves of up to 14 meters high swamped the Fukushima Daiichi nuclear plant, knocking out power and causing three reactors there to melt down. The trial focused on whether former TEPCO chairman Tsunehisa Katsumata and two former vice presidents had failed to take preventive measures that may have better protected the nuclear plant, and whether that constituted criminal oversight. Prosecutors had provided evidence that the men were given data showing the impact of a possible tsunami on the plant. But all three pleaded not guilty, insisting they couldn't have foreseen the disaster. Tens of thousands of people living near the Fukushima plant were forced to leave their homes in the aftermath of the disaster. Eight years on, some have still not been able to return because of lingering radiation contamination.